Hello! Happy Friday! Let's talk about time. So it's kind of been a theme this week and uh, if you follow me on any of my other sort of social media platforms you'll see that this week I've talked a little bit about time but time just is. Like you have no more and no less time than anybody else on this planet. Quite literally, we all have 24 hours every single day. So when we find ourselves saying, oh, I don't have time, you do, you have 24 hours. We can't change the amount of time we have but what we can do is very consciously decide how we want to spend that time. So if you imagine I gave you £24,000 or dollars, if you're watching this, from my international friends, um, how would you spend that £24,000? You know, you probably would sit there and go, right, I'm going to spend £10,000 on a new car. I'm going to spend £5,000 on a holiday. I'm going to save two or £3,000 for nice things that come up. You would, you would kind of plan, or maybe not, maybe you would just spend it, but you could plan how you're spending that money. And time is exactly the same. You get to decide, I want to sleep for X amount of hours. I want to exercise for X amount of minutes. I want to work X amount of hours. I want to spend time with my family X amount of minutes. I also include cleaning. I don't really want to do that. <laughs> But that's something that I have to do within my week. So I plan my time. And what I'm learning to do more, because I'm personally not really very good at this, is I'm planning the time I want to spend looking after me. Because when I look after me and when I love me, and I am fully nourished, I have so much more energy to give to my family, to give to my clients, to give to the world. So that sort of self, that self-love, that, that nourishing time is vitally important to plan especially because you have a human brain and the human brain kind of likes constantly coming up with excuses. It doesn't really want you to do anything new. So it's going to tell you, oh, you don't have time. You don't have time to take two minutes just to recenter. You don't have time to take 20 minutes out to go for a walk. Oh no, you, you haven't got time to do that. But I'm going to offer to you that the opposite is so true. You've got exactly the amount of time you need. You just need to plan how you're going to spend it. So I love scheduling. Um, I do it at the start of my week and I look and I think, right, OK, what have I, what do I want to achieve this week? What have I got to do and how long is that going to take me? And it goes into my calendar. And then the skill then is honouring that commitment and this is where I'm doing a lot of work it doesn't come naturally to me looking after other people like if I said to my boys yes I'll come and help you with the PlayStation I will I will make sure I do that if if my husband wants to go out and exercise I will make sure that he has the time to do that but I I kind of neglect me so this is what I'm learning is that Actually, 
my time is just as important and it makes me a better version of myself when I give myself that time. So asking yourself, like, what do you actually want to do in your day? And there is no right or wrong answer here. If you actually want to sit on the sofa all day and watch Netflix, give yourself permission to sit on the sofa all day and watch Netflix. But make sure you are consciously making that decision. You know your reason why you want to do that. And do you like your reason why? So for me, I love the idea of having a regular yoga practice every day. Not for hours and hours, 10, 15 minutes. I love the idea of going out and getting fresh air, going for a run or just a walk. So planning that time in, even if it's just 20 or 30 minutes, like planning that time in and then honouring that time commitment. And it's the same with your business or with your job. You know, actually putting the time in to look after your job, to look after your business. You have got the time to do that. It's just how you choose to spend your time. And your brain loves to tell you, oh no, you don't have time. You don't have time to do that. It's always going to tell you that. But that's your primal brain doing your primal brain thing engaging your prefrontal cortex and deciding actually no 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 taking 20 minutes out is really going to benefit the rest of my day it will make me more productive it will make me more present it will make me more efficient which in turn is going to have a knock-on effect to everybody else so that's my kind of spiel on time for this week you have the same amount of time as everybody you just get to choose how you spend it um, and another thing, my children are telling me that I should be asking you to like this video, to subscribe to my channel so that you get the notifications of whenever I've done a new video. So if you kind of like what I'm saying, hit the like button, press subscribe, it makes me chuckle because I feel like I'm some kind of cool youtuber <laughs> gaming guru and i'm not but if you like what i'm saying and it resonates with you why not subscribe hit the like button tell your friends have an amazing weekend and i'll see you all next week bye